How's it going YouTube? It is your boy D-Dizzle Dominance here at Common Sense Media. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys once again how to draw a pinup model type character. So, first off you want to start doing is drawing yourself a peanut shape for the legs because it's the easiest way how to get those big bodacious curves for the legs. And it's, it's a lot of trial and error when you're trying to create a character like this. In this character in particular, I'm going to have him standing straight forward, uh, front at center, with one leg coming in in front of the other leg just a little bit. So if you just pay attention to how I'm doing this, you'll see and you have to really decide where you want the detail to be placed at for me it's gonna be mainly in the legs and her chest area so I'm trying to make sure her legs look as nice as possible make sure her thigh gap looks really good and you know just trial and error in it and uh, like I said before in my previous video just keep on making the tubes and things like that make that peanut shape or like upside down bowling pin just to be able to get what you want to get and in this one, I'm not going to focus too hard on the feet because it's not something I should focus on. But on the top, you should always draw a triangle or a form of a triangle just so you can get the top body part. For men, it's more of a square than a, tri um, than a triangle. But for women, it's usually always a triangle just because you can really put that body, upper body outline. And then if you want to, you can draw guidelines for her, her torso, for her chest, where you're going to draw her, her breast set and you just keep on going at it and you just keep on sketching it and to keep on using the shapes and trips the tubes and things like that and just make it really stand out and for me like I said the tubes really do stand out right now this is just a rough form of the image um, I always clean it up afterwards and get rid of all these lines and things like that and yeah as you see I'm just starting to do a little bit more here and there and changing position of body and shape and just trying to really figure it out but but pretty much that's what you want to do when you're trying to develop develop the character's body in question so mine standing straight forward probably gonna have a hand on her hip and having her other arm sleep behind her body where it's not visible and then I, I'll go from clothing after that from there and it really is just a lot of trial and error but once you get the hang of it it becomes easier and easier and easier it just takes practice you gotta grind it and it's the only way to get better, learn new techniques, watch a tutorial video on how to do things, for instance, like this one. But pretty much everyone has their own style of drawing, so people can just draw straight up everything right there and then. But me, I like I said, I require drawing the tubes, the hoops and ladders type of thing in order to get my body form down. And in this in particular video, I think I'm gonna up making this girl like a workout girl and just really do what I gotta do. But I'm gonna speed the clip up here as I start to finalize her outline and then things like that. Now one of the other hardest things to do when it comes to doing a drawing like this is working on the head. The head is always hard depending on position and shadowing and like hair and things like that. It's always hard to choose on where you want this to be placed at. Um, for me, I'm going to have her head kind of slightly pointed down and having her hair droop over her face, give her big hair. Um, in a non-anime style just give her a regular hair I'm also gonna give her closed eyes but this is always the hardest thing in my opinion when it comes to drawing an image now when it comes to outlining it's always just to have a little fun with it you know don't get uh, stressed over it but just have fun make sure your brush presets are set properly to your liking so you can get those nice smooth strokes and pretty much just enjoy it you know figure out the woman's composition make sure you're making some lines more bolder than the others with your pressure sensitivity and um, just really work on it for instance like right here I had a hard time making this woman's thigh gap I actually uh, work on this part right here for quite a while and then I actually come back and I try working on it again because I'm like wow that's a huge gap maybe I should make it more realistic and so um, I do that later on in the future in the, in the video and um, like I said, just have fun with it. Just a lot of trial and error when you're doing the final outlines of your creation. And like I said, I'm gonna make my character like a workout woman uh, in like leggings and maybe like a workout top, maybe type of thing, or maybe like like a tube top. And just have some fun with it because it can become difficult real quickly depending on your skill set, depending on what you want to do or how complex you want it to be. Because you can make this extremely complex or you can just make it extremely basic. And for mine, I decided to make mine a little basic with a little bit of complexity when it comes to the shading. And yeah, it's pretty much it. You know, you just work on the image, you make sure you put 
little lines here or there to show where there's depth and you just keep on working on it and once you get to certain areas you know you can always move things around resize them make them sit, link up with the other line properly and just work on things if you don't like something then make it bigger make it smaller just keep on working on it and yeah that's pretty much the end of this video i'm going to fast forward it through the whole entire coloring process and uh yeah let me know what you guys think but uh, if you guys want any more details or any um, more tutorials, whatnot, let me know if you guys want to know how I made the preset of my brush, my perfect br my perfect illustrator brush, then uh, let me know. But it's your boy Diamonds here at Common Sense Graphics. Rate, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think on how to draw thick women. I'm going to continue drawing in this style, creating in this style. This one right here is actually a commission, so it's actually really cool. And I actually enjoy what I made with this one. And yeah, hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoy the, the ending product. But it's your boy Diamonds, you know what it is, rate, comment, subscribe, I'm out.